Thank you to everyone who's been supporting me, and you can also give extra support if you would like to over on my Patreon. The link for Patreon will be down below. Thank you. Enjoy the video. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how I got the yellow look. I redid red and orange. So yeah, let's get into it. I am so excited. Next video also should be my birthday makeup. I haven't done it. I'm going to most likely do it on Sunday, which is my birthday. So July 2nd, and then I'll upload that to YouTube. If you also want to see an updated foundation routine, please click above. So this is a palette that I use for the yellow. Um, it is not my favorite. I'm not sponsored by anyone, so I'm giving an honest review. I had to dip in this palette so many times. You guys have no clue. It was a lot harder to get the color to pay off like I wanted it to um I started packing in more color on the brush but I still had to go into the palette about like five times maybe just to do one side of one color so I'm just showing you guys and this is a brush that I'm using and this is the second color. I actually did like three colors this is like the second look that I did in this series so it was a whole lot I was like you know let me try a different palette I never use I bought it with the intention of having different colors and vibrancy stuff like that and it's not a bad palette it's just you have to dip into it a lot more than the other palette which I'm okay with I also cut my crease with the Becky Sue eyeshadow primer and that is my brush do not judge me okay like leave me alone <laughs> but yeah so I was just cutting my crease and I did my makeup differently after this one I didn't cut my crease for any of the other ones and I feel like all the other ones came out just as basically the exact same I got my fan to work. I got the pop of the century. I was so in love. Um, also, this eyeshadow primer, like I said earlier in another video, like I said earlier with this eyeshadow primer, <laughs> like I said earlier with this eyeshadow primer, I'm seriously about to give up on it. Um, I whipped out the fan and I started fanning my face. The eyeshadow primer did not dry down and I I tried so hard to make it work but it did not work. I went in with this glitter so I put the glitter on and then I'm like I'm not in frame. <laughs> I'm so sorry and I showed you guys the other side so you guys could see the full look and then I was like let me go in this chunky glitter. It was it was it was cute. It was a moment. Look at that. Not even focusing and I was struggling. I was like girl please. Um, it was annoying. <laughs> this eyeshadow look was so funny to me because not only did I have to dip into the palette multiple times and make sure it was pigmented and then dip into the palette, I also had to go in with two different glitters to get the effect that I wanted. And the chunky glitter was not bad. That was probably the easiest part to this eyeshadow look was just doing the chunky glitter because it was the only thing that was really just popping off like right away. So I did my eyeliner. with this Revlon color stay <laughs> eyeliner and it kept focusing on my mirror basically the whole look and then I realized but then it was out of focus it's focusing on my hand not my eye so I apologize it was I felt so bad 
I just had to put sorry on the screen. Like I felt so bad. And then it focuses. And then it's unfocused again. I, I, I feel so bad when this stuff happens. Like I try to help people who are either trying to learn makeup or people who are enthusiasts about makeup, like MUAs, you know, you're your own little like person like me where you're trying to just do what you like and what you enjoy. And then it's out of focus. Ugh, it's an ick. It's so bad. It is so bad. Like it was so out of focus. And then I looked and I realized. This camera, stop focusing on Trixie. We understand the camera likes Trixie. I do too. <laughs> Damn, stop focusing on the mirror. Focus on me. Love you, Trixie. I know you're never going to watch this, but I love you. Um, but yeah, you know, I did my cute little inner corner moment. And it was pretty much good from here. Like, my hand wasn't in the way. The mirror wasn't in the way. I was very much, like, detail-focused, like... Am I in frame? Barely in frame, but it worked. I don't think I have any other problems with the camera focusing for the rest of the video. But yeah, you know, putting on my eyeliner, doing the thing. And I was like, it's cute. And then I was like, let me do my waterline and tight line. Um, tight lining I believe is when you do the top eyelash and bottom eyelash um so I tight lined this is me doing my waterline tight lining is when you do the upper part of your eyelid so I'm doing the waterline first and then I'm going to do tight lining, which looks really awkward because essentially you're getting the upper part of your eyelid and you're making sure that it's packed with uh, an eye pencil, eyeliner, eye pencil, whatever you want to call it. Um, and this is a mascara. I love this mascara so much. And I was a little bit out of focus, I admit later on i was i was out of focus or my hand was in the way that's what it was my hand was in the way i felt so bad <laughs> i was like no my hand but then it's good and then i was out of focus i forgot okay i'm sorry for lying to you and this is the end of the makeup look and this is what it looks like and yeah uh real life me will tell you guys the outro okay i love you guys bye Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all my other bits of social media. And yeah, thank you so much to everyone who's been supporting me. You can also give extra support if you would like to over on my Patreon. Yes, I have a Patreon and these are the supporters I have. Thank you so much. You guys are all so amazing. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. And please like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all my other bits of social media. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Love you guys. Bye.